It helps if you have it on drill and not remove. <laughs> Look at that. This is our Ikea bag. It's been on our apartment floor for two years, and it's not the classiest way to display your blankets, especially when you're entertaining. My roommate hates it. I hate it. Our cats love it. Unfortunately for them, it's about to go away because I found the cutest way to display your blankets on a blanket ladder. So we're gonna make one today. Let's get started. All right, so you're gonna need to go to Home Depot, go to Lowe's, go to your hardware store, wherever you can buy wood, and get a two by four and a two by six. You're gonna have to ask the nice people at Home Depot to cut it for you. Have them cut your two by four into a 60 inch length and your two by six into four 17 inch sections. Now, chances are after they cut it, you're gonna have some rough edges. Just take a sanding block, coarse grit, and just sand it down. Now that those are all sanded down, we're gonna take a two by four and put it aside because we don't need it yet. And now we're going to measure out the placement for our smaller boards. So the first one is going to be three inches from the top. And you're just gonna make a mark. Then your board is gonna basically sit like that. So this corner is going to measure up with your three inch line. And then you're just gonna line up the edges. The next one is going to be from this back corner here. And you're gonna mark it at 12 inches. That's where this one's gonna sit. You're gonna line up the back corner with your line and make sure it's flush. And then line up your corners like so. And again, 12 inches. Line it all up. Like that. And the last one, 12 inches. Just like so. So now we're gonna go ahead and pre-drill some holes and screw these bad boys down. So now that I have the holes pre-drilled, we're just going to start the screw to put it all together. All right, and just to get it started, and then we're gonna take this board. Now, when you're doing it yourself, you kinda gotta get creative with how you can hold everything together. Make sure everything is lined up with this top edge and my marks. We move on to the next four. Now that we have all four of our rails screwed in, we're just gonna flip it up, put our other two by four right on top, make sure it's square, and then drill it in. All right guys, here is our completed blanket ladder, so no more Ikea bag. Feel free to paint it, to stain it, however you want it, to decorate it, to match your living room. I'm gonna stain it. Follow me on Instagram to see the final product. Make sure to like and subscribe and turn on the little bell for notifications when I have more DIY content like this coming out. Thanks for watching, bye.